Hey folks, TNT Neon here. <clears throat> got a new device that I got for my Quadrino board. It is going to be a Bluetooth device. Let me see if I can get it right in here in the camera. It's a Bluetooth device that you can hook to your Quadrino board. You can order this from uh, wasby.com. I will put a link down below to show you where you can get it from. Also, here we'll have a wiring diagram, how to wire it up to the board. Um, it comes with of course the bluetooth and with this accord right here um all for for 20 bucks um as you see i have it wired here on my board and i will show a picture of where you wire it up at on the board also and um i would try to put up a wiring diagram if i can get it out the uh, the website uh so let's go into it and show you how everything works First of all, you go to the App Store. You can download on any any Android device. I have it downloaded to my Acer tablet, 7-inch tablet, uh, which I really like. This tablet It's a real smooth running tablet. So what we can what we do is go to the Multi Wii configure. We go up to this uh, settings and go to connect. So it's waiting for the connect. Watch the red light quit blinking and the red light on the Bluetooth and stop blinking meaning it got a connection when you first get ready to connect this thing it's going to ask you for a code the code is one two three four that's one two three four um i have uh multi wii 2.0 um on this one so i'm running the pwc on the settings for that and to go into that you'll go into uh settings and you see set pwc and you want that to 2.0 if you run a 2.0 1.9 so far so far um so, and I'm show you wait, right here, it, like you read the settings, hit read parameters, and it read every last parameter I have on it. Also, uh, it has where you can read your switches and stuff also. Um, right here where you can read uh, your channel monitor, where there's a little switch right here below where you can press on and you can watch me move my sticks up and down my throttle you see my rudder my rudder uh the elevator and also the aileron um next thing is the graph which is still on and you see every time i make a movement the graph is working very well for it. um so this is a pretty good advice like if you want to go out and change uh your parameters like you want to go change your parameters uh at the field from sports flying to standard um slow standard flying whatnot you can go in and change it you cannot do updates to from here to here for as like updating 2.0 to 2.1 or whatnot it cannot be done um as far as I know, uh, I don't think it can be done. I don't see it. Update value by sliders. That's about basically it. Um, got a little extra things. Uh, read profile, save profile, uh, take screenshot, uh, reset value. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna save uh, profile and save it up under Franken Quad. And then save the profile. So my profile is now saved. Um, let's see. You can also reset values and whatnot. But like I said, it's it's it's, it's pretty decent. See, I mess with the graphics again. Pretty decent, decent what you can do. Like I said, it's twenty dollars. Ain't a bad item to get. All right, folks. As I always, say God is good all the time. TNT app.